Dear COMNAP members, I am the president of the Portuguese Foundation for Science and Technology, FCT, is the public institution that promotes and funds scientific research in Portugal under the Ministry of Science, Technology and Higher Education. It is my pleasure to introduce Portugal's application for full membership in the Council of Managers of National Antarctic Programs and on why this is of high importance to Portugal. Portuguese polar research gained momentum during the fourth International Polar Year, which led Portugal to ratify the Antarctic Treaty in 2010 and the Protocol on Environmental Protection to the Antarctic Treaty in 2014. After funding a dedicated polar research program during the IPY and following its great success, the FCT created a Polar Office in 2011 that later became the FCT Polar Program. Our objective is to foster and support Polar research implemented to the Portuguese Polar Program, to consolidate the Portuguese contribution to Antarctic science Portugal became member of the Scientific Committee on Antarctic Research in 26, joined the European Polar Board in 28, and became an observer party at COMNAP in 2015. Overall, the FCT's investment in polar research reflects the commitment of Portugal to international scientific and logistics cooperation so important for the holistic understanding of Earth's dynamics. A better understanding of the Antarctic environment and of its global connections is an international endeavour with which Portugal, through its scientific community, is deeply engaged in contributing to. Antarctic, once pristine environments are changing fast and at risk, and only an internationally coordinated effort can contribute to tackling the enormous challenges ahead. Furthermore, Portugal has been increasingly exposed to the impacts of global warming and extreme meteorological events, many of them with processes linked to the polar regions. To better understand this, a truly global cooperative approach is needed, and Portugal is part of it. Scientific advances in the poles, as well as technology and knowledge transfer, help us to better address the environmental challenges in Portugal. The Portuguese scientists are committed to support the international community to better tackle the environmental challenges facing the Antarctic. This motivates Portugal to strongly commit to Antarctic research and benefit of the excellent conditions of the Antarctic to create new knowledge feeding into research and policy frameworks. As an example, Portugal has been contributing to collecting data from permafrost observatories in the Western Antarctic Peninsula through the Permantar Network, a key node within the global terrestrial network for permafrost and an example of Portugal's involvement in the monitoring of impacts of climate change in Antarctica. Portuguese contribution to Antarctic research was sporadic until the end of last century, but with the establishment of ProPolar, Portuguese Antarctic research has grown in scope and relevance over the years. From the Antarctic Peninsula to the Southern Ocean, Portuguese research has been focusing on atmospheric, marine, cryosphere, earth, environment, biological and social sciences, as well as on sustainable architecture, mostly under the perspective of climate change. Topics are as varied as atmospheric rivers, changing permafrost, fisheries and flood webs, and dynamics of research teams, just to name a few. Overall, Portugal has been conducting observations, collecting new data, developing new methodological approaches and delivering new science, which makes Portuguese scientists attractive international collaboration partners. Today, in Portugal, 18 research institutes are regularly involved in Antarctic research, collaborating with numerous international institutions. An equitable community of about 50 Portuguese researchers is actively involved in Antarctic science. Working towards capacity building, ProPolar promotes the inclusion of an early career scientist within each research team funded by the program. Portuguese researchers are also active in SCAR, 
representing Portugal in standing committees on geosciences and on life sciences, as well as in the capacity building, education and training advisory group, as well as having led expert groups within the organization. Dear COMNAP members, it is my pleasure to share with you our activities and achievements. Portuguese Antarctic Research is sustained by projects that are selected through peer-reviewed evaluation with annual calls aimed at stimulating innovative, multidisciplinary and excellent polar research. Since 2011, 11 Antarctic campaigns were organized allowing for 89 projects with more than 160 researchers. Our training and capacity building strategy ensure more than 80 missions of early career scientists in the Antarctic with gender equity of the young researchers involved. The continuity of the Portuguese Antarctic research resulted in more than 200 publications highlighting solid international scientific collaboration and contributing to the consolidation of multidisciplinary scientific and innovation networks for the Antarctic. The Portuguese involvement in key European projects like EUPOLANET is one good example of international coordination. Contribution to the year of polar prediction through YOP special observing periods and YOP sites model in comparison project is another example of international scientific collaboration. With no research stations in the Antarctic, Portugal relies on partnerships with Argentina, Brazil, Bulgaria, Chile, China, Czech Republic, New Zealand, Peru, Republic of Korea, Spain, Turkey, United States of America, United Kingdom and Uruguay for logistic implementation of its annual Antarctic campaigns and activities. Portugal contributes to international Antarctic logistics with an annual flight from Punta Arenas to King George Island used regularly by our partner programs. Since 2012, 11 flights supported and managed by Propolar provided transport to more than 900 researchers and cargo. In 2024, Portugal will organize an expedition with a sailing vessel in the Western Antarctic Peninsula, extending its activities and scientific impacts. As a means to improve environmental data collection, besides the Permantar Permafrost Monitoring Network, Portugal maintains in Sierra Cove an autonomous GNSS continuously operating reference station installed in 2016 and linked to an international network of GNSS cores supporting geodynamic studies. International cooperation is key to Portugal. Throughout the years we have established cooperation sustained by MOUs with Brazil, Bulgaria, Chile, Italy, New Zealand, Spain and the United Kingdom, as well as LOUs with Korea Polar Research Institute. These formal agreements have strengthened mutual scientific, technological and logistic collaboration pursuant to COMNAP's purpose. Within European projects such as EUPOLARNET and organizations such as the European Polar Board, Portugal has been active in infrastructure coordination. A good example was its leading role in the implementation of the European Research Infrastructure Catalogue and Database in collaboration with COMNAP and INTERACT that led to the new Polar Dex developed by EPB. Portugal is active in ATCM, contributing to more than 30 policy papers on a wide range of topics, including pollution, permafrost and climate change, as well as education and outreach. Portugal is engaged in the ATCM's subsidiary group on climate change response and intersessional contact group on education and outreach, working in cooperation with more than 25 parties, observers and experts of the Antarctic Treaty. Since the fourth IPY, Portugal has strategically recognized the importance of education and outreach for the Antarctic. 
numerous projects, workshops, lectures, exhibitions and movies have raised awareness of the value of Antarctica and Antarctic research for Portugal, targeting the general public and in particular the younger generations. The Polar Weeks have been very effective to connect Antarctic research and education, reaching more than 130,000 students, 480 schools and more than 240 educators. Introducing polar science into the Portuguese curriculum has been successfully achieved by Pay Portugal. As such, Portugal has participated in the Comnaps Education Outreach Workshop in 2019 working closely with Apex International and Pay, along with ATS and Comnap partners, our country is committed to ensure continuity of education and outreach activities for the Antarctic, as leverage towards behavioural change for a sustainable future. Portugal is highly committed to the shared goal of protecting the Antarctic environment and its ecosystems, and of positive international cooperation. With these goals in mind, several national organizations, the Portuguese Polar Programme Propolar, the Polar Programme of the FCT, the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, the Portuguese Environmental Agency within the Ministry of Environment and Climate Action, and the Lisbon Sports Medicine Department within the Ministry of Education, all collaborate to ensure that the Portuguese Antarctic activities comply with the Antarctic Treaty, the Protocol of Environmental Protection and the directives from international Antarctic organizations such as COMNAP. A long-term vision and integrated strategic plan for the Portuguese polar science will provide clear overarching objectives and guidelines regarding research and logistics in the Antarctic. This plan will reflect major scientific and societal issues to help Portugal managing environmental change. New initiatives are being designed to support and consolidate the polar science and logistics. An example is an exploratory coast Antar mission taking research by sailboat to Antarctic coastal areas in alignment with the European Green Deal and policies on climate change. The full membership in COMNAP is of the utmost importance for Portugal. As Observer Party at COMNAP, our country has been kept up to date with the best practices for the most efficient management of Antarctic logistics. Portugal wants to start participating and sharing its own scientific and logistics expertise and use its excellent relationships with other nations as a vantage point for cooperation and knowledge exchange. Portugal looks forward to working together with COMNAP to preserve and investigate the Antarctic responsibly by tackling inoperability in logistics, maximization of efficiency and minimization of the environmental footprint of Antarctic missions. Overall, Portugal, with its Atlantic position and internationally recognized scientific expertise and excellent relationships with programs from both polar regions, aims at bridging lessons learned and feeding them into an integrated framework of Atlantic interactions from pole to pole. Thank you.